Hi, my channel name is Second Era of Moles, and if you clicked on this video accidentally, 90 seconds is all I ever ask. This is Stonewall Penitentiary. I wanted to play, I woke up this morning and I was like, I want to play something a little bit spooky scary. So this is what we're going to do. We're going to choose the middle save slot. Again. The, dream. the Martin Luther, Luther King dream? An array of colorful lights lit the room. Jason Voorhees? From Friday the 3rd dream? For oh, it's Christmas. Moment, Christmas tree. I was home. That is not a real Christmas tree. Do people still have real Christmas trees? I don't think we've ever actually had one. Whoops. It is ruined! I love playing with balls in the house. Papa, the boy was busy, forgive me. But I didn't care. Hey, at least he didn't break the window. That would have been a lot worse. Where's the mother? Oh, there's only two stockings, so no mother. Wetness streamed down the boy's flushed cheeks. Ah, poor little booger. Good riddance, I thought. Wow, why did you have children? <laughs> Am I right? Why would you have children if you're gonna treat your son like shit? Despite Jason's distant sobs, I returned to my work. Were you working when he threw the ball? Fire I'd missed, knowing it would not take long for Jason's cries to fade away. Okay. And then, blissful silence. Blissful. A fistful of blissful. I don't think this bit is narrated, so I'll just jump in. The shadowed figure trudged through the snowstorm with determination, carrying a weight that served only to fuel a morbid need to reach their destination. Ooh, that rhymes. Is it all gonna rhyme? It was possible to park the van closer, of course, but that could lead to complications. This was not the first time the figure had followed this path, nor would it be the last. The shadow's back was starting to ache. Not a surprise, considering the bulk of the load. I'll give you a bulk of a load if you know what I'm saying. While the snow could have proved hazardous, Zs and Vs are very difficult to differentiate. The figure was resilient. The weather would not prevent what was to come. Is it a good? Ah, <laughs> it's a naked. Look at that butt. That's a weird-looking butt. The victim had proved easier to capture than the other. He hadn't even put up a fight. This is also no surprise, however, given everything he had lost. Oh, is that me, as in the person that I'm playing as? Did the son die? The question remained, however, would this man and the others confess their sins? Only time would tell. Would you like to play a game? After several more strenuous minutes, the vicar finally reached their destination. Stonewall Penitentiary, in all its glory. Is Stonewall Penitentiary a... Uh, setting in another horror film or TV series or book. I don't know. Up the front steps they went. With the twist of a wrist, the figure propped open the front door and carried the unconscious man inside. He could do bad, naughty things to his bumhole. His trial was about to begin. Trial by fire? Trial by combat. 30 minutes later. Whoa, dude. Does he have a bit of green bum fluff there? <laughs> Well, he has blue eyes like me. I woke up hours later in a daze. Oof. Sting. Did you shoot a load of cocaine? My penis! Where did it go? You don't really feel pain in dreams, do you? <laughs> Look at his perfectly sculpted back. Why would you want to get out? That place seems perfect. It has a bed, and a toilet, and lights. Look at those hands. Ooh, ooh, there's things on the wall. Someone has been there for 5, 10, 15, 20, 22 days. I wonder if that's significant. 
The cell door loomed in front of me, a constant reminder of my captivity. Have you my checked to see if it's actually closed? Because a feminine voice suddenly spoke from behind the right cell wall. Okay. Okay. I'm feeling in a bit of a fancy mood, so I'm going to stay silent. Whether from shock or suspicion, I chose not to respond. That's a trap! Look, I know you're scared, but I think I can help. Please don't be a creepy little girl. I don't like creepy little girls. Okay. Cut myself free of you. Do you want to review? Oh, do you want to view the tutorial? Nah, I'll figure it out. That was a bad idea, probably. Look at the index card. I should find a way Look at my messy best. hair. <laughs> okay, what else is there? Lantern, cell door. What is this? Bed? Something on the bed. Search the bed. I thoroughly searched the bed. Not easy, given that my wrists were tied. Yeah, that would be difficult. Ooh, is it worth something? Circumstances. I wouldn't even bother with it. Is one side scarred? Did it belong to Two Face? I picked up the old penny with my clenched knuckles. Okay. Is it a sharp penny? Can I untie? That was the idea. Now if only I could figure out how to do it. <laughs> yeah. No. I wanna look at the pen penny. Penny! Look at Someone etched several marks into the stone wall. And if someone's etched marks, they must have had something to etch them in with. Something sharp. Arms. Legs. Feet. Bed. Turn around. Oh. Turn around. The toilet paper. Find a soiled bed, a rusted toilet, and a dried sink. An event. Why was I in this place? Well, apparently you committed some kind of sins. So, ooh, look at the grate. Open the grate. I tried to unscrew the grate cover by hand, but the screws were too tight. What about the penny? What about the the penny? Look at a scratched metal grate cover. Ah, I can skip him talking. Open. Okay, what about in the sink? Look at the rusted sink was dry, as though it hadn't been turned on in years. Sinks dry quite quickly, actually. So it might have only been used yesterday. Turn on. The faucet. Them's the brakes, I suppose. Anything under the sink? What about in the toilet? Look at flush. The old toilet was covered in dirt, while the water inside the bowl was brown for me. <laughs> it was mercifully clear of it. Ah, okay, so it's rust and not poop. Toilet paper. Look at. Okay, what about if we take it? It would probably be better to leave that near a toilet. Fine. You know, just do whatever. It still flushes. That's a relief. Because <laughs> I gotta take a massive dump later. What's this? Journal entries. My thoughts. Maybe you deserve to rot in here. I don't want to read all of it. I'm still plagued by Jason. Okay, so something has happened to Jason. An old rusted penny. Oh, use penny on the grates. <laughs> yeah, I'm clever. Night. What about the fourth one? The cover fell open. Ooh! Of metal bars, one of which was broken with Behind it with a set of metal bars. Can I use that? Cut rope with. Just be careful of your wrists. We don't want you bleeding all over the place. The rope binding my hands so that it pressed upon the sharp edge of the broken metal bar. Nice. I then began to shift my arms back and forth vigorously. So that vigorously. Vigorously has such connotations to it. Like... Furiously and feverishly, there's only a certain amount of things that you can do with those adjectives I decided to hold on to or adverbs. Me. I don't know. Okay. I'm free. free falling or free balling? Why would they leave a key? Maybe we can trade keys. No, I looked in the toilet, didn't I? Okay, index card. Look at a small index card set upon the cell's table. Okay, what's written on it? Take. 
Ah, okay. Um, is there a note inside yourself? Was there? Yeah. What did it say? I didn't read it. It says to meet some new friends in the cafeteria. I love meeting new friends. Mine too. Too bad we can't get out of here, huh? You're surprisingly chipper. Rusted key. Look at the key. Look at it. Okay, take the key. I got a key. Try it on the cell door. I was going to. Good evening, William. We've never met before, but know all about you. What? I know all about you. Sorry. Find some clothes and greet your new friends in the cafeteria. They're all very eager to meet you. I'm sorry if that was weird. That's kind of my, uh... Hey, wait. Use it on cell door. Ah, damn it. It's not working. It must not be the no. right key. Nice. I was afraid of that. My name's Jessica, by the way. Jessica Bartlett. Hi, Jessica. All my friends call me Jessie, so... Jessie! Oh. Yay, that means I'm a friend. How did you get here? Okay. What do you work as? <laughs> His hair is just so funny to me. I hope so, but we'll see. I wish. Ah dear. Yes. Jesse, I really don't think this is the time for monkey business. Fully clothed. Got it. Got it. Yeah, me too. Well, um, I gotta say, in support of them, I am naked from the waist down. Just, uh, just a little detail there. Do you know how long You've been here. I. Oh, okay. Well, I've been playing for twelve, so you know. Hey, I do not snore. That is uh, slanderous. Are you dreaming? Don't tell her about the dream. I thought of I'm just gonna kind of skip through these because much as I like the dialogue, it's a bit slow. I don't remember. Uh, where do you work? At a bar? Where do you work? Where do you work, Jesse? Busy Mart. Yep. So she's 24 hour on call. Oh, okay. Unemployed. You dirty bum. Have you seen anyone? Yourself? Nope. No. So she was still knocked out when I got put in here. Is as good as mine. Sure is. What was that? Cell door. Look at. Okay. Uh, maybe turn around. How did I turn around the last time? Bed. Hello. Maybe there are other keys. Good idea. Good idea, Jesse. How do you suggest we exchange keys? Through the bars. They're very wide. I'm sure you could. The keys to each other. We could reach around. You could give me a reach around and and the key. you know take my key in your hand. Good point. Let me know if you come up with something. Like rope, toilet paper, toilet paper. We could string it to toilet paper. Toilet paper. My idea is toilet paper. Did I make that clear? Can I get on? No thanks. Oh, okay. How did I turn around the last time? Cell A2. Ah, okay, so that's a map. That's good to know. What? I want to turn around. Lantern, look at. Okay, what about if we take it? Lantern provided the only light in. Okay. Open. Damn. Okay, how did I turn around? Bed. I'm kind of... Scratches. Look at... I've already looked at that. You're William Thane, a middle-aged man filled with remorse. Find a way out of yourself. I'm trying... What do I got? Rope! Ah, okay. There we go. Use tied key? There we go. Let's swap keys. Awesome. I'm so smart making man. To the rope and throw the key to you. That is a very good idea actually. Great idea, Will. I'll do the same. 
I did not say you could call me Will. But what ifs? <laughs> Look at his butt. Okay, now throw me the key. What if she betrays me? Boop. Is that a good throw? Yes, yeah, good throw. I'm good at throwing things. Jesse followed suit and threw me the key she'd found in her own cell. I caught it on the second try. Well, she caught it on the first try, which means she's better than I am. Stupid. Can I open it now? I tried to open the cell door. Ah! Do I need to use the key? Locked. There we go. Open. No, my key. Use Jesse's key. Jesse's key. Nice. We're free from the cell. Nice one. Take, take the lantern. That's a good idea. See Jake. Jake. <laughs> See Jesse in all her naked glory. Ah, oh, okay. I thought it was actually gonna do it. Niceness. I stepped out of the cell, turned around. Bright eyes. And found myself inside a long, narrow hall that ah, okay. directions. Oh south to the cafeteria. I'm gonna go and say hi to Jesse. Houdini! Yay! Go up to her cell. <laughs> it's strategically dark. She's very pretty. She was clearly terrified. Nice. Hello. Look at. Feast your eyes on her nakedness. <laughs> Sorry, that was a sneeze. Uh, talk to. She wants me to find clothes, doesn't she? Yep. Kind of guessed that too. Lower tower block. Let's go. Guard station. Travel to east upper block. Guard station. They'll have clothes, won't they? I Ooh, the a telephone. Found myself facing an old guard station. Guards. 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 Uh, to lower block. Speaker. Look at. I want. Nope. That's no good. Telephone. Look at it. Look at the telephone. It's a ringer. A di a, a dialer. No dial time. Ooh, showers. Let's all go to the showers. The prison showers. Don't drop the soap. Soap, I mean, not soap. Shower head. Look at, is it going to do anything? Shower head. To guard station. Showers. Nope, okay. So this was a red herring. Security camera. Look at the camera while it looks at my penis. Oh, to north gate. Need clothes first. Ooh, sealed locker. Open. Damn it. Okay, read. What does it say? Was the letter J. Okay, logbook. Read. J. Employee ID. 543. John Hort. Ah, damn it. I didn't want to do that. So, John Hort. Judith Tam. I don't know. Harold Johnson. Um, I'm guessing it's John. John Hart. 943. So, 453. Yes. Unlock. Let's go with 453. Because that was the number of the guy. Yeah, that's why I'm doing it. Rotate. Do it faster. How do I? Rotate, rotate. And pull. Is that the number? Damn it. Read. Four, five, three. Okay, I'm gonna try these. I'm assuming that when I get the right combination, it's just gonna spring open. Ah, there we go. It was Johnson. Nice, nice. Let's get some clothes on. Are there clothes inside? Yeah, there are clothes inside. Ooh, and walkie-talkies. Look at them. Okay, so one for me. Oh, okay. I wanted to take the walkie-talkies, though. Yeah, let's go. 
us as best I could. Mm. I grabbed the lucky three. Niceness. So the guard before me was very fat. He was a fat man. Do I have clothes for Jesse or just for me? Yes. Go to there. Talk to? Jesse, I... I thought I had clothes for you. What about in my sack? There we go. Get dressed. Nice. Yeah, they will. Put them on. Mm -hmm. I bet you took a look as well. Hmm. Okay. Cool, let's go. Let's pick up the pace. Life and times of Jenna? <laughs> but. Lots of butts. Cool. How do the clothes fit? Thank you. You're welcome. You're welcome. Let's go. I would have said both. She has green lips. That's not good. Wait, what was that? What was there was a thing on there? The door. Notebook? Read. It might be important. Anything good in there? Um, could you calm your tits, Jesse? I'm looking around. Do I still have inmate stuff? Oh, okay. July one. I'm sane. I really am. I don't belong here. I may have done a few crimes, but I never had no body on purpose. I do not want to read that now. This way? Where's the cafeteria? I proceeded up the stairs to the second level. It's a baseball dude. The here were smaller and more cramped. Well, I'm glad I didn't end up in one of them. Lower block. Let's go. I'm guessing it's past the guard station. It North gate? In the hallway to wander around. The note okay. Is it not here then? Ah, it's a cafeteria. Would help if I looked around a bit more. Hello, everybody. I am William. Uh huh. One, two, three. Okay. And the last guests in our little melodrama finally arrive. Oh, is he the leader? Is he the leader? Is he the guy who set this all up? Why would he be there, though? He's suspicious. I do not like him. Wow. Looks like I'm the only woman. Figures. Yeah, well, you probably die first. You all? No. Too? Yes. I don't like him. He's creepy. We all got notes telling us to meet here. He's suspicious. His voice is very deep. Oof. Grayson, you are creepy. Hi, Gerard. Who's the other guy? You're in that thing! No, I haven't had a view at all. <laughs> yeah. You ain't that famous. I know lots of things. I know my own name. I know that no one else here knows me. Okay, I'm hoping he dies first, and then that guy. Yes, I will sacrifice you all to save me. Start by, ooh, a TV. It's an old TV, it has an aerial. He looks like one of them things in that episode of Doctor Who. That voice is funny. I can't put my finger on why it's funny, but it is. Okay. Yeah, the one with Madame de Pompadour. Because he's got the, like, 
18th century style clothes. Okay. Hey, whoa. It's because the high pitch bit overrides the low pitch bit. That's why. There's no, there's no justice in this world. I don't know why. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. It is now midnight. Okay, or what? Accept responsibility for your offenses. Okay. Seems easy enough. And there's the catch. Die. Shouldn't it be crimes? Just. <laughs> My question to you now is. I'm guessing I'm gonna die last. Damn it. Oh, okay, so that's the end. Coming soon. Thank you for testing this beta demo. Please click anywhere to close the game and open a short survey that will allow you to provide us with invaluable feedback about your experience. My only feedback is that that voice was silly and not scary. <laughs> oh dear. Okay, my my two criticisms were that voice is, was not scary at all. That just made me laugh. And the other one was that maybe it moved a bit slowly. I don't know. There didn't really feel like there was any tension building. But this was Stonewall Penitentiary. It's free to play on Game Jolt. As always, there'll be a link in the description to the game. If you want to go and play it yourself and then leave them some of your own feedback, I'm sure that they would appreciate that. And if you've made it past the 90 second mark, thank you very much and congratulations. If you've made it this far, maybe you're willing to go a bit further. You can follow me on Twitter. I'm at RainmakerNO12. Or you can subscribe to the channel for notifications of future videos. Thank you very much for watching this one. And goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs>